In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the quick unboxing and a complete setup of your Canon Pixima MG2522 printer. So this is a very good printer for personal printing at home or school because it is a USB printer. You plug it in with the USB cable to your computer or your MacBook or your laptop or a Chromebook and you can directly print and scan from there. It comes with the starter ink. Also, it comes with the USB cable that is included inside. So let's start with the unboxing. That's the printer. So we have the ink cartridges and the power cable and this is the USB cable to connect your printer with the computer or laptop. Now remove the protective tape and you remove this cap, close it. So power cable goes here, that's the black part at the back. So I can show you here, it looks like this. So take the USB data cable out. Connect one end here, so that is for the USB. Now switch on the printer, so go to the control panel. Press the power button once and we have to install the ink cartridges. This printer comes with the two ink cartridges, that is 243 black, 244 color. Now take the ink cartridges out of the box, so remove the seal from here, remove the orange seal from here and remove the orange seal from the coloring cartridge. So ink cartridge chamber is there, just add here. First Open the ink chamber so you have to push it out. Now place the black ink cartridge here. So place it in, let it go in and then you have to push it. It will automatically go upwards. Now close the ink chamber door. And paper output tray is here so just slide it out. Now load the paper, so open the paper tray, place the pages here, adjust the size, go to the web browser and open the Canon website, go to the web browser, type in Canon IJ setup, select Canon official manuals welcome, that is the Canon website, start setup, type in your model number MG2522. So you can see it doesn't display the model number on the Canon website but we can just enter 20 or 24 and go click on the go button because the drivers are same for the MG2500 series so there is no difference click on the download so that is MG2500 open file so it displays Canon Pixima MG2500 series, click next, select your country and click next, select all and click on the next. Now connect your printer with the Windows laptop and wait for the installation to complete. Next is to do the print head alignment. So click execute and click on the align print head
So this is our alignment page. So open the top scanner lid, place the page like this facing downwards and click color or black any any one of the button and wait for the alignment to go through. Now it says the setup is complete. Now you can click on the next button and agree with the terms and conditions if you want to go for the survey program or you can just do not agree and now close all the windows if you want you can print a test page so click on the execute and it will give a confirmation if the printer is working properly or not so that is the test print and we can see it has properly displayed it that means printer is working now go to the window screen and finish all the setup process go to the window screen and click on the next button and click exit close the windows now we can start using this printer for scanning and printing I'm going to show you how to scan so go to the start button click all apps scroll down and look for the Canon utilities and here we can see Canon IG scan utility open it so this is a small window where we can start the scanning process and place a page on the top scanner for scanning it will display your printer as a Canon MG2500 series we can scan to photo document and we can do other things so click on the PDF document so scan is transferred simply click on the exit button if you want to add more scans then place the next scanning page and click on the scan button now exit so on the next page we can see our scan is available if you double click on it so that is our scan page so this way we can do the scanning overall it's a very good printer for home and office use the only problem with this printer is like if you want to reinstall or change the ink cartridges or install ink cartridges then you have pushed the paper tray in and because the gap is too little so it might be not possible to place your hands inside properly and to install the ink cartridges so if you have bigger hand it might be a little bit difficult otherwise it's a very good printer for home and office use thanks for watching